Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. Wale Akorede Okunu is one of the top comic actors we have in Yoruba movie industry. He's among the top 10 richest actors in the entire Yoruba movie industry. And he was rated as the 7th richest by Things to Know, who estimated his net worth to be $450,000. Another site, Money247, also rated Okunu's net worth to be for fifty thousand dollars it was not like this for this test period at the beginning he was paid just 60 cobra nera for his first acting room the first time he got paid on this job was in the year 1984 when he did a stage performance in the bad door in Oyo State. and after that show he was paid 60 cobra nera he said he ran mad that day he never knew he could receive such huge amount of money and at that time 60 cobra was a good amount of money as Nigerian currency had value back then. Well, he might be among the richest actors today, but his journey was not smooth. He has been acting since his primary school days, and his first role was in the 1979. Those days, they usually watched Ogabelo on Awada Kari Kari, a popular TV series. Then they would call his friends and they would rehearse everything Ogabelo and others did. When he was in secondary school in 1984, he started acting and collecting money. That was when he collected those cobbles. He realized then that he could start taking this acting thing out of their school and make money. And that was exactly what he did. They took their state shows to secondary schools and raised some money. But his parents never supported him. So he always got beaten whenever they went for a show or rehearsal. And when this veteran left secondary school, he went to Ibadan Polytechnic where he studied fine arts. That was the day in 1989. And was still acting by that time. Later on, he traveled out of the country to Saudi Arabia. When he came back, he involved himself in business. He did buying and selling of things like clothes, bags, and shoes, which he usually purchased in Saudi Arabia. So whenever I was in the country, he went to movie locations. Then he stayed in Nigeria for a month and went back to Saudi Arabia for more goods. Then he would stay back in Nigeria for like a month go back to Saudi Arabia for more goods and he did this for a good 13 years before he finally settled to acting. Well, today, Wale Akorode Okono regards the decision of facing acting squarely as a blessing. He is both successful and fulfilled in this profession. And today, he's one of the top 10 richest in the entire Yoruba movie industry. Wale Akorode Okono which is net worth will be expected to have one of the best houses and cars because he can afford them all. However, this actor does not show off on the social media platform. And you will not hear it in the news that Wale Akuridok will not buy his house of cars. But then, in the year 2015, he revealed that it was on this acting that he built his house and bought his car. So definitely, he's a house owner and he has his vehicles. Wale Akuridi, apart from his acting fees, is also one of the actors with top mouth-watching endorsement deals. And what you will see him post on his social media platform are mainly business and some pictures of his wife and his kids. He's happily married and he has three lovely kids whom he relocated to Canada some years ago. So those ones are based in Canada, his wife and his kids. He has a boy and two girls. Also, a lot of people do not know this, but he didn't start as a comedian. He was just a normal actor. The truth is that he can act any role because acting flows in his blood. In the year 2007, when he wanted to shoot his first movie, Ishia Mole, he contacted one market, Alaji Kazima, for lying, and he told him about his plans. But then, that marketer had seen him in a movie, Ishia Ji, where he played comic role. So he advised him to rather go into comedy. And that was how he became a comic actor. So this is a little bit about this comic actor, Walia Koride Okuno, who is one of the top comic actors we have in the entire Nigerian movie industry. And also one of the richest, top 10 richest Yoruba movie actors. Please stay with us for a short but interesting biography of Wali Koride Okuno. His name is Wali Koride Okuno, and he's popularly known for his comic roles. He's currently one of the most sought after actors and influential actors we have in the movie industry. He's known as Okone, even though his real name is Wale Akorite. He was born in the city of Ibadan on the 5th of November in 1967, and he's originally from a boomer short part of Oyo State. He started fine arts, as mentioned earlier, in the Polytechnic of Ibadan after his secondary school education. Although Wale Akorite never revealed anything about this actor revealed that growing up was a little bit terrible for him when he was young. He was very stubborn and hard-hearted. And because he had passion for acting, his parents never were in support of this. He started acting partially immediately after the death of his father in the year 1982. And he became more stubborn. He even ran away from home several times. And whenever he came back home, his mother would beat him mercilessly. So when Wale Akuridi realized that 
The only thing she does was to beat him. He would run out of the house for days. And when he returns, he would have been prepared for the beating because it was more or less like a routine for him. After a while, his mother had no choice than to give in to what he loves doing. So when Okuni realized that the only thing she does was to beat him, he would run out of the house for days and when he returns, he would have been prepared for the beating because it was more or less like a routine for him. After a while, his mother had no choice than to give in to what he loves doing. Okuno, as he's fondly called by his fans, was once a businessman and came into the movie industry through a fellow actor, Miwa Ademola, who is a movie producer and actor. And ever since he came into the limelight, he has featured in several movies. Due to his comic roles and skills, Okuno has become a household name in the movie industry. He has backed notable awards, which includes City Bubu Movie Award for Comic Actor of the Year Yoruba, and he's happily married today to a beautiful wife called Wumi, and their union is blessed with three lovely kids. It was also revealed that Okuno relocated his wife and his children to Toronto in Canada. He met his wife in the year 1995. When he came to Nigeria from Saudi Arabia, he used to come home occasionally, and they met in the Dubai of Ibadan in Oyo State. He revealed in an interview that things were not rosy for them at the beginning of the marriage. But then, his wife endured with him. Another woman would have left him during that period. Many people even advised her to leave him. But she stayed. So anytime she did anything to offend Okuno, he always remembers their trying moment. And he knows she's a wonderful woman. He was asked in an interview that between love and money, which is more important in marriage, this version Yuba actor says that love is important. When there is love, there will be everything. God stays where there is love. God will put money where there is love. He also revealed that at the early stage of their union, they had a lot of disagreements. When there is no money, there is poverty. There will be disagreements. When you see a couple without any disagreements, there is money in that union. If your wife needs 10,000 Naira and you give her 50,000 Naira, there will be no problem. On how you got to stage thing, Okuno, this actor likes to use names which people readily remember. He heard the name in one of the songs of the late Sikuru and Inde Barista in the year 1984 and he wrote it down. All the characters in these movies bear uncommon names. Also, he was asked why celebrity marriages do not last and he had this to say. Marriage is not something one drops into. One needs to pray well and be sure because it is for life. Any marriage can collapse and it is not only celebrity marriages that don't last. People talk about marriages of celebrities because they are famous people. This young man is an indoor man. He could be away for work for three weeks. But then when he's at home, he spends quality time with his wife and his kids. We have come to the end of this episode. We hope you enjoyed it and let's know two new things. Subscribe and hit the bell icon for our daily content.